Hello friends, very good evening. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Talent Traders. Those who are new to my YouTube channel, kindly subscribe the channel to get more update on intraday and positional trading strategies. In this video, I am going to discuss about the stock selection based on the Bollinger Band. So using Bollinger Band trade strategy. So at the stock selection, which I am creating the scanners by 5 minutes and 15 minutes. So yesterday we have struggled to uh, create a spinning tough and a hammers. So I have just now completed all the scanners here on this video. So this one, the first link is for a doji kind of thing. So we are going to find a doji candles at this moment by doji. And the second uh, formula which finding a hammer kind of thing. So we are going to find a hammer. And third one which is going to find out a spinning top. So spinning, spinning top kind of candles. So all the three, what we are going to do, if the stock and the Bollinger Band, which making a hammer, doji, or a spinning top. So all the three bars, which must be uh, forms below the lower Bollinger Band. So that I'm going to focus the stock for a reversal trade. And main importance about this strategy, which I'm going to use, the first candle should form the pattern in the after immediately the market open so when such a kind of uh, thing is happening on that particular stock there is a chances of reversal in the trend should be very high so this is what a five minutes we don't have find out any five minute stock and the same which i've created for uh, 15 minutes that was working good so even a lot of times we can create as a lot of time frame so either 10 minutes or 15 minutes even 20 minutes also we can create so in 15 minutes a uh, scanner that may be working well and today uh, we have some stock and uh, regularly we got uh, some stocks and that i'm going to discuss about here in this video and hammer that is also working well so everything that is happening to the lower bollinger band so in 15 minutes time frame that i'm going to show you that this is what a 15 minutes at whatever the time frame which is mentioning here on the five minutes so if you are changing all the time frame to 15 minutes then that should be the uh, strategy or that should be the scanners for a 15 minutes time frame. So let me go for that today. Poly Cup India, which forms uh, the pattern among those three, either it may be a doji or a spinning top or a hammer kind of thing. So let me look at that of uh, Poly Cup in a 15 minutes time frame and using Bollinger Band. So it must be happening at the lower Bollinger Band. Let's look at this. This is what a candle, which is, looks like a hammer, hammer pattern which is present on polycap the first 15 minutes so this is the area where we are going to find out the first 15 minutes uh, it's a hammer so i'm not going to focus for a selling opportunity but main idea where i'm going to focus the buy opportunity whenever that hammer candle high should break so what was that hammer candle high today that is what exactly uh, at the time it's about two, two, 2606 and 2577 so near about 23 and almost near about 30 point stop loss and then it made maximum of uh, 2635 almost 35 points it's reached and middle price if you are focusing that should be 2627 that target got triggered but after that it not returned back and the entry got triggered by only 10 15 after within a three candle that went up to some 30 points right so this is what the scanner which we have used to find out the stocks which belongs to the lower bollinger let's look at that this is what thing happening at around two o'clock uh, almost uh, doji uh, sorry spinning top hammer this three here it is a hammer and there is another hammer but this one is not happening below to the lower bollinger band but, but this one is happening below to the lower bollinger band but that point we don't get trade opportunities but if it is a pattern which is happening on the first five minutes, first 15 minutes or a first five minutes candle, that may be a great opportunity where we can focus on intraday trades. So this is what a today's trade that may be worked well. And let me go to check about the historical data. And yesterday we have one stock on 15 minutes time frame. It's about Alchem Laboratories. Here we are seeing Polycap and yesterday it's about Alchem Laboratories. Let me look at that Alchem Laboratories, what is happening on. Let's look at that hammer kind of thing which is forming in Alchem Laboratories. The result on 14th 11. So the same which is happening on 14th 11. 
where I'm going to take this entry on 15 minutes time frame. So from 3084-3025, somewhere around 50 rupees. Right, 50-60 rupees. And then it went up to 3217. Almost uh, it reaches max uh, from 84 to 100 and 200. So almost 120 points that was generated but that five minutes candle it's gap lower but it started moving higher so this kind of thing which we are going to find out by using this method and previous one about three stocks three four stocks which is happening and tata motor srf take him and rec let me go for a tata motors and that tata motors only issues that yesterday i have also faced issue but it looks like a uh, not a candle pattern but it was showing you something about the stock on 10th of November maybe the earnings the data may not be getting that in stock and 10 11 915 so let's look at this maybe the candle it may be a hammer candle let's consider as a hammer candle and this should be the entry point but still the entry is not triggered but after the uh, next day the entry triggered from 420 and the stock is performed well Tata Motors and then the second one is about SRF and TechCam. So SRF, what was the pattern? So three candles we are finding out and SRF. Let's look at about this SRF that is forming a um, maybe a hammer. That means a red hammer, which is forming at the 10th of November. But that high is not broken. But after that, the high is broken. Maybe that point, um, we may not be getting opportunity 2378 that it went up, but it's a positional one. So we are focusing for an intraday opportunity. Then that day is not given you any opportunity. And the second one is take him and RSE. Let me go to check take him. The same pattern, so it's not about take him. Take Mahendra. So what the pattern? Yes, look at this. This is what the thing which I'm focusing for uh, in the stocks where it is forming exactly uh, the hammer candle. Once the high of that particular candle, 1013 is broken and it went up to 1034. What was the risk for the trade is just about 1013 to 1005 so almost 8 rupees risk and then it went up to more than 20 and still let us keep on going higher and it was stopped this is happening on 10th of November. and that about REC limited that is also be the stock which we have filtered out based on the pattern so maybe a uh, hammer but this one maybe the data uh, it's calculating sorry spinning top at the bottom it's exact spinning top at the bottom right so exact spinning top and that high we are expecting to break because these are all the stocks which forms at lower Bollinger Band. So we are expecting the stock is going to up to the middle band or even it may be touching up to the top band. That is what they expected we are created. Even lot more I am going to create using Bollinger Band. It's a uh, best indicator where we can make a lot of trading strategies using Bollinger Band. So and this is what a start of that and a five minutes hammer doji and the spinning top these are the reversal candle which is happening below to the lower bollinger band and the same thing which we can use for a upper bollinger band so finding out the stock uh, on upper bollinger band that may be so i'm going to give you uh, this scanners so you may be creating like that you can take a screenshot at this moment uh, for this for uh, spinning top and this for an hammer and above one is about doji you are familiar with my youtube channel most of the scanners which we are finding out about a doji so you can take a screenshot i have already saved 15 minutes so i'm going to plan a create a dashboard so after making the dashboard that may be a great opportunity due to the power issues and some other uh, problem on my inverter so cannot able to conduct a live session maybe tomorrow also i think not possible yet but once the, the system is ready then we can go for it uh, that's about the system which we are finding out based on Bollinger Band. So I hope you understand. So those who are work know well. So this is what the code you can copy and create this code. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, hit a like button and share to your friends. If you have any questions or a comment, just comment on this comment comment box. If you liked it, just hit the like button and share to your friends. And uh, let me know about my voice and uh, audio quality. Will it is improved or not? Please, yesterday I have a comment and then I, rec I uh, heard about, about that videos and it was a very poor quality audio and now I have to do something and maybe it's working well. I hope you enjoyed this video kindly.
subscribe to the channel. Thank you.